Mice pie, mice never tasted so delicious. A miner is trapped in a mine containing three doors, A, B, and C. Door A leads to a tunnel that takes him to safety after two hours of travel. Door B leads to a tunnel that returns him to the mine after three hours of travel. Well, door C leads to a tunnel that returns him to the mine after five hours of travel. Assuming that the miner is at all times equally likely to choose any one of the doors, what is the expected length of time until the miner reaches safety? Can you solve this problem? Pause here if you want to figure, out, figure it out yourself. Please like this video Now let's see how we solve this problem. Now here let x denote the time until the manner reaches safety. Let y denotes the door he initially chooses. By the law of total expectation, we have expected value of x equals a summation over y this conditional expectation times the probability for y equals lowercase y. Now, that is to say, for our problem, the expected value of x is simply equals the summation of these three terms. Now, the expected value of x, given that the, the first door is a, and the probability y equals a plus the expected value of the time given the door chosen initially is b times the probability y equals b and finally plus the expected value of x given the door is c and times the probability for y equals c. Now because as we know, the miner is always choosing one of the doors equally likely. Uh, therefore, these probabilities for y equals a, probability for y equals b, and probability for y equals c is always 1 over 3. So therefore, we have the second equation. Now, all these three terms have 1 over 3, so we can take 1 over 3 in the front and times this is summation, which is the third equation. Now, the question becomes, if we can find the summation in the parentheses, in the bracket, then it should be good. Now, what is the expected, these expected values of x? under different conditions. Now, we realize that, okay, if the miner choose door A, it will lead him to safety in two hours. That is to say, this expected value of X, given the miner choose door A, is going to be just a two. Well, if the miner choose door B, then he spent three hours in the tunnel and then returns to the original place. That is, returns to the mine. But once he returns to the mine, the problem is going to be as before. And hence, his expected additional time until safety is again expected value of x. Therefore, we have 
expected value of x given y equals b is simply 3 plus expected value of x. Similarly, we have the expected value of x given y equal to c is 5 plus expected value of x. Then, by substitution, we have the following equation. To simplify this equation, we got the expected value of x equals 1 third times 10 plus 2 times expected value of x. If we multiply 3 on both sides, we get 3 expected value of x equals 10 plus 2 times expected value of x. Multiply, if we subtract, subtract 2 expected value of x, we get all right, the following, and the expected value of x is simply 10. So therefore, if the expected, the expected length of time until the manner reaches safety is 10 hours. That's how we solve this problem, by using the law of total expectation. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.